Welcome to this last lesson on integration by parts. This time we're going to integrate secant cubed x. Before we do that, here's a pop quiz. Do we know how to integrate secant x? How about secant squared x? I'll give you some time to think about that. Got it? We know the derivative of tangent is secant squared, so the integral of secant squared x dx is the easier one. That's tan x plus c. How about secant x? This comes out as the log of absolute value secant x plus tangent x plus c. I'll do this one in the appendix in case you haven't seen it before. So let's get on with the example. Evaluate the integral of secant cubed x dx. All right, the tip. Pick the hardest part we know how to integrate. What's that? You got it. Secant squared x dx. So we're going to think of secant cubed x as secant x times the secant squared x. Let dv be the secant squared of x dx. That means u is secant x. Let's find du du is secant x tangent x dx, and v is tan x. The integral of secant cubed x dx is equal to u times v is secant x tangent x minus the integral of v du. That's the integral of secant x tangent squared x dx. Uh-oh. This looks harder than the one we started out with. But is it? No, there's a trick to this one. I'll give you a hint. By using a trig identity, we'll be able to produce the original integral. Did you get that? Okay, here's a very useful trig identity. Tan squared is secant squared minus 1. Let's multiply those two factors out. That gives us secant x tangent x minus the integral of secant cubed x dx plus the integral of secant x dx. The given integral popped up again, so now we could rearrange the terms and solve for it. We have 2 times the given integral equals secant x tangent x plus the integral of secant x dx. And that's one of the integrals in the pop quiz before we started this example. So we have secant x tangent x plus log of absolute secant x plus tangent x plus, I'll add a c1 now, dividing both sides by 2, we arrive at our answer. The integral of secant cubed x dx is 1 half secant x tangent x plus 1 half the log of absolute secant x plus tangent x plus c. All right, let's move on to the appendix. Let's see how we find the integral of secant x dx. This is one of the trickiest integrals ever. 
The way to solve this is to multiply both the top and the bottom by secant x plus tangent x. When you multiply the factors in the numerator, you get secant squared x plus secant x tangent x, which happens to be the derivative of the denominator. So it is in the exact form of the integral of du over u, which is log of absolute u. And that's how we arrive at that conclusion. Okay, so that's the end of integration by parts. If you need to see any more problems done, just let me know. Bye.